My name is Jim Lee. I'm a publisher and chief creative officer for DC Entertainment. Can you talk us, walk us through the DC Universe experience? Yeah, uh, this is a first of its kind uh, digital subscription service where DC fans can come together and celebrate all things DC. I mean, we're aggregating a ton of amazing shows and films from yesteryear and combining it with a lot of uh, new original programming that we're going to have available each and every week of the year. Uh, on top of it, we've got an amazing uh, selection of thousands of comic books that people can um, read. Uh, we're going to curate those and rotate them on a regular basis. Um, by curation, I mean that we're going to basically show you books that inspired the shows that, or the content that's available in the app. We're going to introduce you to the creators that worked on those comic books and kinda have them help kind of walk you through what happened, the creative process of making those books. And then on top of all that, we're also introducing community. Uh, we're going to really create a safe and inclusive area for fans to come together, uh, create uh, playlists, uh, rate their favorite content, share it and communicate and, and really interact with each other in a way that really didn't exist before. So we feel that this is an amazing experience, a real central hub for all DC fans to come together. And it's an amazing value because it's $7.99 a month. Can you run through the new experiences you were talking about, the new shows? Yeah, so uh, we have four new shows uh, up on deck, three of which I can talk about now. <laughs> the first is Titans, right? It's produced by Greg Berlanti and Jeff Johns. Uh, Jeff Johns co-wrote the pilot. Uh, he wrote uh, like three on his own and co-wrote another episode. But it's really their adaptation of the core, you know, Teen Titans uh, group. Uh, it's got Robin, Starfire, Beast Boy, Raven. Uh, it is real hard-hitting. It's a coming-of-age story. These are characters that are kind of uh, broken and come together to find solace and uh, belonging. And so it is really uh, a great show, and we're ex really excited by that. And then out of that show, we're seeding Doom Patrol, and Doom Patrol will be another series that uh, spins out of that show. And if you're familiar with those characters, they're very eclectic, quirky, uh, misfits kind of shunned by society, and they're kind of finding their way um, Robot Man and Niles, uh, Calder and uh, Last Girl. So there's a lot of really great <laughs> concepts in there. And it's based on the original uh, comic book from the 60s, but also uh, the very influential Grant Morrison run on the book uh, many decades later. So, and then on top of that, we have horror represented by Swamp Thing, right? And so there's a lot of tonalities that we're exploring. And then the fourth series will actually be announced tomorrow afternoon. And that's yet a completely different kind of tonality. So we're very excited for the shows that we have uh, in the pipeline, and we're looking at a lot of other different DC concepts to explore from single uh, character, uh, you know, character studies to other team projects. I mean, a lot of really, really cool stuff. <laughs>